Welcome back to my channel guys. It is your girl Biggie. If you can please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already and let's get into it. Alright bitches, I know it's been a hot fucking minute. It's been a minute since I've been on here. It's been about two years. Um, the last video that y'all did get to see of you girl, I was having a baby. He is now two years old and he's running around this house somewhere. Um, I'm gonna put this disclaimer out right now. Yes, I know you can't really see my eyes because of the fucking, um, because of these lights that I have on right now. And truth be told, I got these glasses on because I hate my eyebrows. I did like a, a, a shit job on my eyebrows today because I need to get my eyebrows done. So, yeah, I thought I could like fix them and move around like the whole situation and shit without my girl. Fuck it. But the skin is skinny. Like everything else ate. Um, I did something different with my blush today. Like, ooh, I placed it back here, like up on the cheek, high cheekbone area, instead of like on the actual cheeks. But see, yeah, anyways. So today's video, obviously, we are doing a Christmas, Sephora, Ulta, and I think one other place type of haul today. Just sharing a couple of things that, um, one that's actually a repurchase because I got gift cards from these places. Um, so a lot of these are repurchases and then a few things are brand new. So yeah, let's get into it, shall we? So I'm gonna be sharing some things that I got for Christmas from Sephora, Target, and Ulta Beauty. Um, a lot of this stuff I purchased on my own because I received gift cards. So yeah, you know how that go. I'll be telling family like, don't give me anything. If you're gonna give me something, gift cards and cash. That's it, okay? So, um, this first box is actually a body care box that I received for Christmas from my stepmom. It's a body care box, and I think this is from Target. I see a lot of Target um, brands in here, or not brands, but like products, and I think I've seen these body care boxes in Target. It might have been Ulta. I think this was in Target, though. Um, it says it's valued over $38. A lot of it is... Um, a lot of the items in this box are travel size and sample size. What the fuck? It's been a long time since I recorded y'all. So I'm like, I'm a little anxious right now. Okay. So in the body care box, uh, it has the Hemp's Original Her Herbal Body Moisturizer. I almost said herbal, child. Um, the Curel Ultra Healing Lotion. Ooh, I heard about them, but I don't know how good they are. Mm. Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula. I'm going to be using that. I'm gonna be using the hemp's. Um, there's Love Wellness Bye Bye Blow Dietary Supplement. I'm gonna be definitely using that because we love a flat tummy, okay? Like, I'm already a flat stomach girly, but after having a baby, yes, the abs are there, but that, that extra pooch, you know, down there, like, she gotta go. She gotta go. Eczema, uh, no, it's called Exa, yes, yeah, Eczema Honey Body Lotion. I'm gonna give that a try for Zay. I'm going to see how it go for him because my baby got eggs more of Um, The liquid IV hydration, multiplier, and tropical punch. And then there's one in golden cherry. I have the Eco Tools Delicate Eco Poof in Glacial Blue. And the Eight Greens Daily Greens Gummies in Apple. Sun Bum, Sun Bum Original Sunscreen Lotion and secret uh dry uh, dry spray sham um shampoo secret dry dry spray deodorant so let's get into it and i think the only full size thing in here is the secrets we finna see okay. oh ooh. so this is my little squishy this is the eco tools delicate eco poof so let's see the products this is the Bye Bye Blow by Love Wellness. Ooh. It is really cute. I'm gonna like pop one right now. Low key. When do it say to take it? It says about Bye Bye Blow. Digestive enzymes, organic, fenugreek, fenugreek, Greek, and organic ginger root helps support normalized water retention from food, monthly changes, and more. Ooh, so. Sounds like they was looking out for women for sure. Cause I heard huh, monthly changes. You know how that shit goes. The Sun Bum 
Uh, sun bum. Sunscreen. Obviously. This is the Cruel Ultra Healing Lotion. This is going to be good for my hands. Because, like, yeah, we in the winter time. But in the winter, it ain't really been that brutal. Low-key it has been, especially at nighttime. I'm probably going to give this to um, my closest friend, my homegirl. This is the Hemp's Lotion. I'm excited about the eight greens made for real greens. I'm excited about this because I see them in Target all the time. This kind of what made me think this was like a Target box because a lot of these brands are in Target and they promote, I know Target promotes these brands a lot, largely. But hey, I love me a good moisturizing um, body oil, but Palmer's coconut butter, uh, I mean cocoa butter formula, baby. This means, that means the oil smell like the lotion. That's what that's saying. Mm. Mm. Damn. Yeah, it's lit. This is the eczema honey, eczema honey body lotion, full body moisturizing sample. It's so teeny tiny. Two packs of liquid IVs, the golden cherry and tropical punch, of course. I'm definitely gonna be using these on like drinking days when it's time to get lit. Yeah, don't mind me, y'all. My nails look a hot mess. I know I'm gonna get my nails done later on this week. Don't judge me. And lastly, the full size product, the secret. And this is in Water Lily. So, ooh, it has like a fresh smell to it. Yeah, ooh, you know what? This reminds me of third grade. Ooh, what the fuck? This reminds me of third grade girls' bathroom. I don't know why. I don't know why. So, yeah. So that was cute. That was the body care box that I received from my stepmom. Thanks, Christine. Let's bro. So now we're about to um, get into the Sephora bag. I only picked up four things from Sephora this time because I was on time crunch and I was really in the mall getting Zay stuff um, like the rest of Xavier's Christmas together. And um, my dad had already given me like my gift cards and shit like before because he came and picked up my grandma um to go home with him for the holidays and shit like we should have went but i was like eh, let's just me and zay just stayed in town so i love sephora and i got some stuff that i needed like i already used so i already use um the kale and green tea spinach vitamins superfood cleanser this shit is my holy grail as you can see like she's empty She's damn near empty. And a lot of this product was lost from like me traveling and shit. So I did it. I did it. Girl, don't do it. I'm not gonna do it. I was just thinking about it. I did it. I was contemplating cause obviously it's cheaper to get the, just buying a whole new thing. But if I can buy a refill and I got this for $10 off. So usually these are like, $75 or something like that. Yeah, they're like $75. I don't have a receipt. The receipt is in my email. So basically, actually, and I'm gonna go back and get another because they have a gift set of this and the um and the original together. So it's like a refill in this one together. Baby, I'm gonna go back and get that because this is listen, I'm the type of girl when something works. We're gonna run it through the ground, okay? Like, I don't have the time to like try new products. And while I do have the time to try new products, I'm not really looking to do just that because I love the products that I use. I am a huge fan of um, Youth of the People and I really enjoy the Kale and Green Tea Spinach um, Vitamins Superfood Cleanser. I really do enjoy this cleanser because um, it's not harsh. It doesn't have like a smell to it. It's it's a clean brand. Um, obviously, it's vegan as fuck. And um, yeah, like they trying to save the planet too and shit and the people and the youth of the people. I don't need it. Oh, oh, this is the refill. Bitch. <laughs> ah, 
and you telling me all I gotta do is just pour it into this one? That's it? And then I'm gonna still have more left? Girl, I, that's why I'm going back. That's why I'm going back to get another one of these. And I'm gonna go get the, um, I'm actually gonna go back and get the gift set like I just told y'all. Cause yeah, this right here is my swag. Whatever Soulja Boy said. So the next thing I'm about to show y'all, I attempted to um, flat iron my hair. And while yes, I do know like, it does take technique and shit like that. And actually I'm not even finna put this item down because this shit, actually fucking works like i got a little hump in my hair right here because i didn't do a good job putting it put uh pulling it back today but baby color wow this is the extra strength dream coat ultra moisturizing anti-frizz treatment baby she girl let me tell you about her this was made for us y'all this was made for the girls like i love this shit for sure um I actually have the original version as well and that's the one that I actually started with and then when I went to like use it like I looked at some tutorials and shit I was seeing the girlies the girlies actually using this one I'm like fuck I saw this one but I wasn't sure um so it says powerful anti-humidity anti-porosity spray for extreme dehydrated hair and curly slash coily hair types so basically you have to spray this on wet hair and then blow dry your hair to make, to activate the product. Baby, she worked, she worked. But that's like a product review video for another day. Let's keep it moving. Okay, so basically the foundation that I have on right now, which is my favorite, it is the um, Makeup by Mario uh, foundation in 22C. And that is what I'm wearing right now. I'm actually using the sample that I received from Sephora about two or three weeks ago. And I am in love with this shade, you guys. Like, first of all, this bottle look a little crazy with the like shimmery stuff in it. And I think that's just it separating. But it has shimmer in this shit. But it's not like a, it's not like a, a noticeable shimmery, I guess you could say. So I like that. So I learned you just gotta shake shit up, literally. But this is it, and I'm in the shade 22C. This is literally, I don't know if Mario made this one for me in particular or whatever the fuck the case may be. But baby, this that shit, and I ain't gonna hold you. Like, this is probably gonna be the only, well, I can't say that because I love NARS. I'm a NARS girly, like, between NARS, Fenty, and Morphe. I, that's the type of girly that I am. But now Makeup by Mario got me. Like, I fucking love it. This foundation is so smooth. And by the way, I don't even have on primer right now. I actually have on nothing but God's grace, okay? So look how this foundation actually looks. Don't pay, don't pay attention to my eyebrows though, but just get into how this foundation looks on my skin. Like it is amazing. It is extremely flawless. And I mean, you gotta have like good skin to like make sure the products work too. So be sure that you're cleaning your face and doing everything that you can to make sure that you have a clean canvas for your makeup. Okay, so the last item that I got from Sephora is a fragrance and it's a fragrance that's near and dear in my heart right now and I actually wanna get the full size. I'm gonna get the full size one of these days but you gotta like, I think they claim they have the full sizes in the back but yeah girl, they only have the uh, like travel sizes in the, um, in, the, in the actual store. So this is Juliet has a gun, vanilla vibes. This smells so fucking I found this shit on, um, I actually found this fragrance on, uh, I might have been scrolling Pinterest, uh, yeah, Pinterest. And I was gonna get like, I think it's the original or some shit like that. But baby, baby I was like, first of all, I'm dead fucking broke, okay? So, I'm already running out because I be spraying her the fuck down, okay? And I'm like, fuck, how am I gonna replace this goddamn travel size fragrance? And I'm broke. Shout out to my daddy. 
so this is the bottle this is the travel size bottle this is actually a nice travel size bottle personally and it's called vanilla vibes <sighs> it's giving corporate it's giving boss bitch it's giving don't fuck with me or i'll fuck your life up like i fucking love this perfume like I can't wait to get the um, larger size for sure, for sure. Like, I can't fucking wait. Oh, I forgot. I think she got this. Um, oh, another gift that I did receive from my stepmom is well from Target. I think this is from Target. I'm not sure, but it's a brush set. It's the perfect, quote unquote, perfect 10 brush set. Um, it's $10. I have no idea where she got this from. A couple of the brushes are missing because I wanted to go ahead and try them out. Um, I think these are synthetic brushes. It has an eyelash comb and eyebrow brush combo. That's right there. There is an eyeshadow brush, a crease brush, a blemish brush, powder brush, flat eyebrow. Really? Oh, that must be it right now. Um, contour, foundation, angle, eye powder, eyeliner, and flat. Oh, wait, flat eyebrow and then angle cheek brush. I use one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three. I've only used three of them. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, cute. So the next store we're gonna go into is Ulta. Y'all know I love Ulta. Okay, so I'm excited about this bag in particular because I got a little bit more than I did in the other store. Um, plus remember I was rushing in the other store since I was there for um, Xavier. So this one was, this, this stock was indefinitely for me. So I'm excited. Okay, so anyways, let's get into it. So I did get the NARS Laguna bronzing powder and I got Laguna eight, no, I got Laguna six. Um, so this is like a purse powder. This is like, um, it's a bronzing powder, but I'm gonna use it for like all over because this one's actually in my shade in particular. So I'm excited, like, let's get into it real quick. Oh, look at that, look at that. Ah, that shit looks so good, yo. I'm so fucking excited to get into this. Like get into her, for real. So pretty. Such a nice, it, it just looks, I love NARS because they do get it right. You feel what I'm saying? Like NARS actually do get that shit right when they're supposed to, when they feel like it, you know? So I am, it's like I'm almost reverting to my old ways in a sense. And you just, like I was saying earlier, you can't, if don't fix nothing that ain't broke, okay? Shit be trending and that's just what it is. It's cute, it's a trend. Like it's cute for the time, right? But holy grails are always gonna, holy grail. Bye bye. Max Fix Plus. So here's the story. I was in, I was in Marshalls about a month or two ago or some shit like that. And I seen the Mac Fix Plus matte version. And I was like, damn, it was like two or three dollars because it was on sale because then nobody want the shit. So I was like, fuck it, let me buy the shit. I haven't had Mac, I haven't really used Mac products in a long fucking time, but I love Mac. Mac will always be my, like, my true introduction into makeup. My mama used to wear it. So I would, that's what I went to buy. Mac, that's my shit. But I ended up getting the Fix Plus, the original formula, because I I want, I love my matte looks. I love my matte looks. But when I just want that regular, just a regular natural looking skin look, not dewy, not extra mattified, just me. You feel what I'm saying?